as you can see, unfortunately I wasn't able to find a way to kill the alligator without the Setite knowing that we were going to kill the alligator. But, just because I couldn't find a way doesn't mean it's impossible. So, if anybody who has played this mod knows a way to do it, do let me know and I'll Evening, make Kindred. a video in the comments. I came here looking for you. Do you have a moment for a word? Uh, sure. Thank you. But I'm not here to show you my powers. Uh, I didn't say I that. I would like to speak with you about an important matter. Uh, okay. Never mind. I probably should have clicked. Your discipline is very impressive, but never mind. Very well, I hear you. My name is Beckett. I have been watching this cult for the last few years. They have been gathering information about several artifacts, so it called my attention. Uh, I know about these artifacts. I'm not going to press you to talk about it. I know a lot about those items. I'm here to warn you. Warning me? About what? The artifacts that you're looking for are not dangerous per se. But I suspect that they could be involved in a sinister ritual. I think he's meant to say suspect, but never mind. Your knowledge is impressive. Tell me, how do you know all these things? I devoted my own life to find out about our origins, and in my search, I have learned about supernatural triggers, species, and rituals. I see. What do you know about this matter? Tell me, have you heard the name Akabeel? Yes. Akabeel was one of the 200 angels who refused God's command and followed Lucifer. There are cults worshipping him who believe he taught the signs of the Kabbalah to humankind. He is said to be a prince of the Nine Hells. She was a force of evil in the world for centuries, but an ancient group of Magi used the Kabbalah signs that she taught them to imprison her, using several artifacts. Then, they hid those items in different places hoping that they would never be found and brought together. Okay, uh, one of the things I forgot to actually mention or show when I was actually talking to the cult leader the first time, King Solomon was actually an awakened, a magi, and that's why he sealed the demon away. I didn't know this history. I suppose not. And probably not those human cultists either. That's why I told you. If this demon is released, the world will lie in darkness. Do you want me to stop looking for these items? Could be an option, but if the artifacts were destroyed, it would be better. Very well. I will find these items and bring them to you. Very well. You can find me in Paris. I have a haven in that city. The front of this place is the central pharmacy store. You can find the door in an alley, close to the river warehouse. I will be there until this matter is solved. Evening. Okay. So we finally met Beckett. Now, I missed him in my first playthrough, and I was quite sad about that, because I was like, how did I miss him? That was because I didn't do this cult quest. Now, if I had done that, I would have been able to have met him. But I managed to do it in my second playthrough. Now, you may have noticed that when I came back from the Peruvian jungle, I was actually looking behind me. That, besides the fact I was trying to turn back, um, I was actually expecting Beckett to show up, but he didn't. That's because he only shows up once you get the third artifact, and, you know, to give another option for the, to do the quest in. So we have two, so we have two options to do the quest. Do exactly what the cult wants, or do what Beckett wants. I think doing Beckett's route is the most sensible. And it does, I will explain when we get there forever, but it does, it is a better option to do what Beckett says. Hello, you need to travel yeah, to somewhere we're, we're, else. We're going to, we're going to Venice. We're going to the Vatican. Hmm. Now, <laughs> you may okay. notice I did it very fast. Okay, good way from here. The Vatican, I didn't say that. This place is a square, is a country. We come down to I didn't say that. Whatever. Um, everyone's assuming I say something that I didn't say, but never mind. But the point is, um, his way is the better way. I'm going to say that right now. <laughs> I know it's meant to be crazy, but... <laughs> nice use of these different animations, by the way. Man of Satan, how do you dare to come here? How do you dare to step here? Uh, sorry sir, I don't know what you're talking about. So silver dog won't save you from your deserved bullish. Uh, please stop the scandal. Definitely. Looking that we 
are in a public place. But we track you have, you have no place to hide for me, but because we will be dispensed by my hand. Uh, but it's fine. Yes, yes, as you say. Good evening. Back to you. Having that, okay. Alright. So the person's not here at the cafe yet. Well, let's go into the mannequin. I'm sure we can get there just fine. Ow! You can't move. This is a secret. This is truly a sacred ground. A place of truth, eh? Darn. Well, it is extremely well taken care of. It has tens of tons of followers taking care of it. And now the man we are looking for is in here. Hello. Hello, I come from Rune. Rarun, you know. Finally you appear. I don't like this place. I can feel thousand eyes on me. I know what you mean. I think I won't be able to perform the task. No. Why? Uh, I can't go inside the Vatican. Don't ask. This is the problem. Don't worry. The goblet is not here. I suppose that is good news. Where's the goblet? We must move to Venice. We. Oui. I should go with you. Venice is plenty of agents of the Society of Leopold. I know how to avoid them. Society of Leopold? You don't know about them? They are the modern Inquisition. A secret society that protect ancient relics and from the enemies of the faith. I see. I should go with you. Venice is plenty of agents of the Society of Leopold. I know how to avoid them. Very well, let's move. Good. Where is your farm? Follow me. Yeah, you definitely want to take him with you. It's uh, super useful if you do. You ready to leave? Yes, he will come with us. We must move to Venice. Venice. Very well. Let's go there. Go! Very well. Now we're in Venice. We could arrive yesterday if we had traveled during the day. Uh, this was an option. I don't understand your reasons, but we gave more chances to our enemies to track us sleeping in Rome. It's already done. Doesn't it make sense? Doesn't make sense to keep talking about Very it. Very well. Let's move. I called my contact here. A boat is waiting us. We can avoid the hunters using it. Good. You're very helpful. Let's go. I will wait inside the car. I have a bad feeling about this place. What do you mean? Two cars were following us since we departed. I think that you could expect an ambush. Maybe or maybe not. If I'm not here before sunrise, leave. Very well. Good luck. Keep the engine running. Alright. Okay, so I'm just gonna save here. Um, I'm gonna I am gonna keep this video if uh, I do crash, because <laughs> I'm not filming this again. It'll just be a mini-parter. So this is helpful, if we have him with us. I've never done it the, any other way, because I always thought it made sense to have him. Alright, so we're just going to sit here, and this is just going to be a little boat ride. Now, I just like to keep crouched, because it makes me feel comfortable, but... I guess we're going to have a nice good look of what we end up skipping. I always thought this is how you default to this way, but that might not be true. Now, fun fact, I actually tried to do this mission really early, but then I discovered I was too squishy to. So I had to kind of wait until I was a higher level to be able to do this mission, because uh, the boss fight kind of tricky. Very annoyingly tricky. Look, more society of Leopold members. So we could have fought those if those parts if we didn't. All right, I'm going to actually take a dot into Fortune because I'm going to need it for this boss fight and the next one. Now, since I am doing a Beckett's route, you are probably going to be like, "That's really underwhelming." Don't worry, I am going to do a bonus video where I actually do it the way the cult wants to do it. You can place your bets on how well that goes. <laughs> the only issue that I feel like I'm going to have with that is it was a bit crash heavy last time I did it, but who knows, it could be different now. Because there were definitely some points where I was like, this is really crash heavy and it wasn't, but you never know. Like I said, this mod can be quite 
unpleasant with the crashes. Alright. Okay. Great. The church is just around the corner. You can expect company. I suppose you won't come with me. Sorry. I'm not a fighter. Those hunters will kill me for sure. Very well. You have been very helpful. Thanks. Thanks. I hope that you and our beloved leader remember this, and when Akadil will be summoned, we'll know it. Good luck. Uh, sure. Thanks. Safe travels. What's wrong? Alright. Yeah, and save. Just in case. Alright. Got a pill bottle. What is with all this lag? Okay. I'm sorry, I'm just super concerned about this lag. Alright, I'm gonna save here and hope we don't crash and uh, this boss fight goes well. <laughs> Thou shalt pay dearly for thy crimes. Damn you! Oh, this sucks. Tut, tut! We must mollify thy distemper with slow dismemberment. Ow! Thank you for shooting him, guys. Really appreciate it. Can I, can I stop being affected by true faith? That's great. Okay. And then, darn it. What? Damn you. Okay, stop. Okay, so once I fully fed on that one, I'm gonna actually use possession on one of the hunters. Luckily, they're not doing a ton of damage onto me, so that's good. Oh, alright. Stop doing that. Yeah, you kill him. Damn you. So, I'm just gonna quickly... What can I save? Should be able to save now, okay. Damn right. you. Darn it. Damn you. Stop abusing it! Okay. Damn you. Yeah. Ah, it's very annoying. Damn you. Stop using your tree face, sir. I will say this is easier with firearms, of course. Ah, there we go. We're having this problem, aren't we? Love that for us. Ah, they're one of those creatures. But literally, I'm wow. I'm not really taking any damage. For this. That's great. No? Not gonna come down? Well, I guess I have no choice because he's gone. Hey, it's always good to pick up your enemy's guns if you need to. Alright. Damn you! Now this could be a bit... Buggy fight times, but damn you. Good. Go ahead and go in the wrong place. This fight's a bit annoying too. Come on. Get stop. Stop. 
No! No! Oh no. No, 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 no. Am I stuck? Fuck. Okay. I'm gonna have to no clip out this one. Sissy, stop damning me. Come on. Alright. Where is he? There he is. Damn you! Damn you! Luckily, he's not doing too much damage to me. Ah, oh, got him. Okay. Get me out of here. Oh no, I'm stuck on these stairs. Why? Okay, so I guess I'm not meant to fight on these stairs. Great. Well, at least I have a way off these stairs, at least. Uh, regardless. This is over. So this requires seven, and that chest requires eight. So I would definitely wait until you have this item and this item, and you have enough lot picking. Great. We have the goblet. Alright. So I'm just going to save. Talk to him. Hey girl, you licked that this fat bastard, ha. Yeah, he was a true believer. His faith hurt me. Hurt you? Those guns look more dangerous than this ground with a cross. You're a strange woman. Whatever, move out. Yes, let's go. If we leave now, we can be in ruin before the dawning. I noticed that you have a skin problem or a night person. Uh, yeah, skin problem. Let's move. I mean, they can know about Akapil, but they can't know about anything else. Okay. That's weird. Alright. I'm going to cut it here. And once we come back, we will be in Japan.